ISIS on election day, my election day, and this is ISIS now. So that's the way it goes. I don't mind. I mean, frankly, I told the House, if you want, let them see it. Again, I say, a deputy, because of the fact that the Attorney General uh, didn't have the courage to do it himself, a deputy that's appointed appoints another man to write a report. I just won an election with 63 million votes or so, 63 million. I had 206 to 223 in the Electoral College, 306 to 223. And I'm saying to myself, wait a minute, I just won one of the greatest elections of all time in the history of this country, and even you will admit that. And now I have somebody writing a report that never got a vote? It's called the Mueller Report. So explain that, because my voters don't get it, and I don't get it. Now, at the same time, let it come out, let people see it. That's up to the Attorney General. We have a very good Attorney General. He's a very highly respected man. And we'll see what happens. But it's sort of interesting that a man out of the blue just writes a report. I got 306 electoral votes against 223. That's a tremendous victory. I got 63 million more. I got 63 million votes. And now somebody just writes a report. I think it's ridiculous, but I want to see the report. And you know who want to see it? The tens of millions of people that love the fact that we have the greatest economy we've ever had. I'm going to Ohio right now. They were going to close the plant. It's where they make the tanks. It was going to be closed, and I stopped them from closing it. And now it's thriving and doing great. And the people of Ohio, they like Trump because I've done a great job in Ohio. And I've done a great job all over the country. That's what the people want to hear. What do you want to